Hello friends, welcome to our channel Learn and Explore. Today in this video, I will show you how to convert UTM coordinates to longitude latitude data. Okay, earlier in our channel, we have shown that how to convert UTM coordinate to lat long coordinate by the help of global mapper. But this time I will show you how to convert these coordinates. Uh, how to convert these UTM coordinates to lat long data by the help of QGIS software. Okay. Earlier we also have shown that how to convert lat long data to UTM data by the help of QGIS. Okay. Now today we will do the opposite. Okay. Those who don't know about QGIS software, you can uh, download it from the web that is freely available. Okay, just search uh, on Google QJS.org and you can download it from the QJS.org site. And this is a open source GIS software and it's freely available to use. Okay, and this is this also very important for GIS and survey engineers. Okay, so now um, also if you are a survey engineer or civil engineer you can go through our channel you can find more helpful videos like this okay and before proceeding this video i request you if it helps you then don't forget to give a like on this video and subscribe us for more relevant videos like this okay now i'm going to convert the this UTM coordinate to lat log by QJS. So the step first step is arrange your data like this point ID, easting and northing format. Okay. So then simply copy the data. Simply copy this data and open notepad in your computer. Okay. In the notepad, paste it and save this data as okay i'm just giving a location here okay now save this data as csv format okay now i'm giving a name just uh, data input okay input dot csv okay so save this data as csv that is comma separated value format so i'm saving it now close okay now open qgos software okay here i opened uh, you i am using qgos 3.4 version you can download it from the website okay so i am going for a new project go to project menu and create a new project okay there in the left side of your uh, layer panel and browser panel you will find this comma symbol and this will show the like this add delimited text layer okay so i'll go for this click here and a dialog box will appear data source manager and select the file what you have saved from the notepad okay so i'm gonna select this file this is the file data input csv okay i'm going to open it here you can see uh, there is a geometry definition of the point coordinates okay now uh, here also one sample uh, showing in sample is here now i have imported this data but the sample is like this okay so I'll just use the regular expression del delimiter, custom delimiter. Okay. Now the data is separated, and number of headers to line discard is zero. So now I can see that point ID is sting and nodding. Okay. So I'm um, I have to omit this uh, row one. Okay. So I'm giving this number of headers line to discard is one. So now you can see that field 1, field 2 and field 3 are separated from each other. Okay. 
now in the x field okay in the x field what i have to select is the string value and we have the string value is in field 2 so i'll choose field 2 and for the northing i will choose field 3 okay now here uh, there is some uh, geometry crs system okay and i have i have told you that my coordinate system click here okay you have to click here this GRS system and uh, because my coordinate system is in top 46 north UTM format so I will choose 46 north you can search it here UTM 46 here you will find that UTM 46 and WGS 84 remember the datum is WGS 84 okay so I'm gonna choose this and okay now it changes now I'm gonna add it and then close so the points what I have in my excel sheet is imported in the QJS software okay now uh, I have successfully imported it now to convert this data to lat long what you have to do just uh, in the layer layer panel right click on the imported layer and export you can find the export option then go for the save feature as click here and save vector layer as format will appear here and in the format you have to go for csv that is comma separated value yeah this is comma separated value csv okay and uh, give a output name and a directory of the output file so i'm giving a name as data output okay output dot csv now save and in the CRS, you have to change this system from UTM to normal geographic reference system. Okay. So I am going for here select CRS and you have to search for only WGS 84. Okay. WGS space 84. can find this this is geographic coordinate system okay there there it is wgs 84 the whole geographic coordinate system okay so just click ok and here in the layer option in the geometry tab you have to choose as xy otherwise your data will not be exported or x uh, or else y x that means the longitude will be fast and a you know latitude will be fast and longitude will be thereafter so i'm choosing as x y okay now then okay a message will show you that layer exported successfully okay then simply go to your uh, file where you have saved saved this and i will open this data data output csv i'm opening it see here it is we got the longitude and latitude for this easting and northing values okay now simply copy it and go to your uh, excel sheet right click and paste so very simple you can try this by yourself only okay and if you have any doubt about this video you can restart the video and watch it and if uh, you need the help from me you can comment here below okay so that i can solve your problem thank you guys for watching this video see you in the next video bye bye